it is technically like literally beyond the point of like money could never buy this out the mistakes that you have made all of you who are part of that group you've made so many mistakes your money is irrelevant I hope you understand at this point what the fuck is really going on. Your friend Navin caused this shit. Your friends caused this. You guys aligning with people like Bird in the first place and sharing the same opinions like with people like Miss Joe and then watching her in fucking Bird's chat with the wrench. Like you guys knew what the fuck was going on and you sided with him a long time ago. You guys fucked me over and believed this piece of shit and let fucking Katie do four or five hour long live streams on me and you were down with it. That means that you guys sent even Richard Cheese after me and you gave them the okay to fucking come at me and hunt me down like I was an animal. You fucking traitor pieces of fucking shit. They talk all this shit about Steph. They talk all this shit about Tonic. They talk all this shit about Bird, about Andrew. It's just like, but then they end up being the same fucking thing as them. It's like at that point, there's no right that you have to fight for me at that point. Like, there's no right for you to come over here and pretend to play fucking size. Like, you know what you stand by. Don't you dare try to change the way you are. You are what you are. And that is exactly what the fuck you guys are. Like, it's just, I don't want to hear any excuses. I don't even want to pretend like you guys give a fuck. It doesn't even matter at this point. What you guys have done and let happen for the past year is unforgivable. Unforgivable. There is no amount of money you can pay that can make up for what you did. Like, fuck you guys. You guys have no idea how serious you've taken this. I will never, ever, ever forgive you fucks for this shit. It's like literally your cult. It's literally your group's fault. It's because you guys are in a cult to begin with that it's like you guys are at fault. You guys don't even get it. It's your trying to gatekeep everybody else that caused this to begin with. It's like all of a sudden you guys can align with Ra's Illusion's belief system. There's no right for you to have to come over here and then pretend like you disalign with their beliefs. Like fuck you and how dare you lie to people. That would be the same thing as me going into Tonic's chat and hanging out there, just sharing the same opinion with everyone else, even though Tonic hates my fucking guts. Like, it would be the same thing as hanging out at the Drama Dome, knowing that Andrew is sending people out to stalk me and my mom. But by the way, y'all, I'm just going to sit in that fucking chat and hang out and, and share the same opinion as every one of you. Does that make any fucking sense at all? Like, they all have separate opinions. They supposedly don't agree with those people, but then they can all gather around in the same group with the same opinion within the same chat and agree with each other on one certain topic, regardless of whatever it is. It's just like seeing that happen and play out the way it did, there's no way you guys can like say that you're not part of that clique. And you are definitely part of sending these people at me. That's exactly what is going on. And you know what? Sweet and Huck, you know, they feel a little guilt. It's just like, well, no, how about fix the issue and stop your fucking friends first before you ever come around here and give me money again? Like, if you can't get these people to stop doing four or five hour live streams on me and they're your fucking friends in the first place, don't you ever dare fucking donate to, to me again. Don't you ever try to speak out for me. Don't you ever fucking sit there and say you were my friends. You guys are sellouts and you're just like Stella right here. Just like this floppy titty ass fucking bitch. You are no fucking better. <laughs>